What do a little tramp, a cowboy, an enchanted beast, a hard-boiled detective, two cross-dressing musicians, and a handsome ad executive all have in common? Nothing. But they'll all be at the North Park Theater on Classic Movie Night. There are many things one can say about the movie Stagecoach. One can talk about how it won two Oscars for Best Actor and Supporting Role and for Best Music Scoring. One can also talk about how the hat that John Wayne wears in the movie is his own, and he would wear it in many other westerns to come. In addition, local Navajo Native Americans played the Apaches in the movie, resulting in a huge economic boom for the impoverished population. Director Orson Welles would watch Stagecoach over 40 times privately while making his hit classic, Citizen Kane. It would take about 64 hours to do this. This was also director John Ford's first western with sound, and also his first collaboration with John Wayne. The two would later team up many times to dominate the western genre. Stagecoach has had a huge impact on the western genre, influencing every movie of its kind afterwards, even movies like A Fistful of Dollars, the theme of which is playing right now. Finally, Stagecoach grossed almost $1 million in 1939, which is just over $17 million today. To compare, this is right around the same gross as the movie Still Alice, which took home the Oscar for Best Actress in 2014. Though I can tell you all the things that make Stagecoach a classic and historic movie, one cannot truly really appreciate it without watching it. So, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you John Ford's 1939 classic, Stagecoach. <laughs>